Hello everyone, and welcome back to the channel. 1,000 Pound Sisters follows the Slayton's weight loss journey as they try to watch their calories to qualify for gastric bypass surgery in Season 1, and through the Slayton sisters' different life journeys in Season 2. You might be wondering where the sisters are now. We'll be answering that question in the video today, so make sure you stick around till the very end so you do not miss out on any details. Without further ado, let's begin the video. With the debut of the series in full swing, fans are wondering if the Slayton sisters have revealed anything about their weight loss to date. Where are the 1,000 pound sisters Amy and Tammy now? We have the scoop on their weight loss journey so far and what the emotional TLC will cover. With a combined total weight of over 1,000 pounds, sisters Amy and Tammy realized that their lives were being greatly affected by their weight, so they knew they had to do something about it. Amy's biggest wake-up call was when she wanted to get pregnant with her new husband, Michael. However, she had extreme diabetes and very high blood pressure, so it was not very safe, it was a catastrophic health risk and a near impossibility for Amy to get pregnant, even though she is only 31 years old. But she managed to deliver a baby boy gauge by taking all the risks in November 2020. On the other hand, Tammy got very depressed and her health got bad. She told People Magazine that things are so bad that she even tried suicide, which is very sad to hear. The two sisters knew that if they do not lose weight, they are not going to live for much longer, so they decided to do something about it. I had a feeling that if I didn't make changes now, I wasn't going to live past 35. Tammy, who is 32 years old, said about knowing she needed to make a weight loss change immediately. The sisters revealed some things they did to lose weight. They said they have been cutting sugar out of their diet, and they are eating healthier versions of foods. Amy lost 100 pounds, and Tammy managed to lose 49. Tammy moved in with Amy and her husband after living in the hospital. The sisters living together once again were determined to lose weight. In some ways we drifted apart from each other because of the fighting, but we're still sisters and we love each other, Tammy told People. Tammy said in an interview, I don't feel like I have to wear a mask or hide my body when I leave the house anymore. Tammy said to people, I'm not afraid to let people see me. She also said that she is planning on moving in with a boyfriend and getting a full-time job. I can go to the store and not worry about my looks because I feel good about myself regardless of what other people say about me. I'm beautiful the way I am, Amy concluded. After Amy Slayton's pregnancy, Slayton told people she doesn't get as many hate comments as I did about a year ago. Through 1,000 Pound Sisters, Amy Slayton lost over 100 pounds and gave birth to her son, Gage. Amy is adjusting to life as a new mom and living quite happily with her son and husband now, and Tammy's new life in the assisted living facility could be an enticing plot point for fans of the 1,000 Pound Sisters Season 3. TLC confirmed 1,000 Pound Sisters will return for Season 3. On March 15th, TLC announced amid soaring ratings that Tammy and Amy Slayton would appear on fans' screens once again. This was amid the show now having the highest rating in its daytime slot among women between the ages of 18 and 54. Amy came a long way, and we cannot wait for Season 3 to see the new journey of Amy as a mom and her interesting dynamic with her sister Tammy. Are you excited about the new season? We surely are. Let us know in the comments down below. Anyway, be sure to leave a like to the video if you enjoyed it, and we'll see you guys in the next one.